Okay, we're um, back again with some LXG Fortnite, and um, uh, I just wanted to apologize uh, for the mix-up yesterday. I wasn't able to pronounce the name of the sponsor, and they sent me a better translation of that, and also some other things translated from Russian. And uh, so I would like to thank our sponsor... Polyrol Lea Dreva. Po polyrol, good old Polyrol Lea Dreva. It's uh, the vodka that clears your conscience and your memories. Um, so, right now, we're playing as Waldo. And uh, we don't have any weapons, otherwise, we would just jujitsu all of these guys. Um, but it wouldn't be a fair fight if we just fought them straight up unarmed. So we're going to hide because that's Waldo's number one special ability is to blend in uh, to any scene. And I'm sure there's going to be a barber pole or um, maybe a, a candy cane or something. A, a, an enormous uh, procession of people dressed as Santa Clauses somewhere around here that I can hide in. But until then, I'm going to put on this helmet and body armor. And I'm going to grab a rifle, and I'm basically going to try and see if I can't kill off some scrubs. Because, uh, you know, the traditional LXG way of doing things is you just get in there and you just shoot them all with your bullet time. But apparently if you die in these games once, you have to start the whole game over again. Um, and it's kind of bullshit. Because back in the old days, you could die as many times as you wanted, as long as you killed more people than than everybody else. But no, it's different. So we're going to kill this guy. Um, nope, he just he just Bruce lee the gun away from himself. Uh, so I'm going to try and get the high ground and uh, murder him. Oh, nope. Nope, he's armed. He's got friends. Oh, gotta watch out for those Bruce Lee players. Oh, you see, Bruce Lee's dealing with him, so I'm just gonna let my enemies fight one another. Um, and I'm gonna scavenge the battlefield while they duke it out. Some Mazel Tov cocktails, a stun gun, alright, very nice. Uh, all things that are very, very useful. Um,. Let's see here. Hang on a second. Um, let me just do an, a like a air airdrop thing here. We're gonna take a bunch of stuff from this. Um, and Waldo's about to get real. Um, so as the uh, scrubs deal with one another and uh, we divide and conquer. Uh, we just need to, uh, think about the macro strats now, because in professional Fortnite, you know, it's all about the macro game. So we're going to look at the areas that we need to get to, and I think El Pozo is probably the best spot, you know, on the map for late game, uh, development. Um, and it looks like that's where everything's going, so we're looking pretty good. So I'm going to fire this, uh, no one in particular. Uh, because it looks cool. And next order of business is uh, we're gonna run toward. Help! Oh, someone's calling for help. So uh, that means that we need to go save one of the little oompa loompas around here that uh, might be stuck in a pit. So everybody, uh, no, this isn't a live stream. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep an eye out uh, for uh, a little orange man in a hole. Um, and I'm gonna pick up these items, and we're, nope, I can't, no, wait, I can pick the lock. So this building has a lot of advertising on it. Um, and speaking of advertising, that reminds me of our sponsors, that vodka that I said before. Um, crap, what was the name of the, oh, shit! Well. Sad thing is, that's probably going to be my best run today. 